FPGA stands for. So what is the full form of this FPGA? The options are Fast Parallel Gate Array, Fast Programmable Gate Array, Field Programmable Gate Array, none of the above. Now what is the correct answer? The answer is a third one which is Field Programmable Gate Array. Now this FPGA or Field Programmable Gate Array, this is what? Here you see this is the FPGA. So it's an integrated circuit that can be reprogrammed to perform specific function after it's being manufactured. So you can program it again and again to solve your specific purposes. That is why this field programmable gate array FPGA became so important to the electronics industry because it is reprogrammable even after it's being manufactured. So the phrase uh, field programmable in this field programmable gate array FPGA it refers to an FPGA's ability to be programmed in the field or after the chip has been released from the manufacturer. So Xilinx, it's a technology manufacturer who have developed this and it was first introduced, the FPGA's was introduced in 1985 for the first time. Now I would like to show you a peak hole view of this uh, FPGA. So this part you see various programmable logic blocks, all these four which you are seeing in the broad view. And these are all the programmable logic blocks, the logic gates as you know. And these are the interconnection, these are the programmable interconnect. Through FPGA there are different programmable possibilities. Now if you want to make a counter for example, this FPGA provides a very simple way of doing it. You can write a very simple code in VHDL and this VHDL code can produce this counting facility using the FPGA.